Honey Pinters. Hi there. And welcome to another Pond Side Chat. Hey, we're back Pond Side. We are. I like it. It's nice. And it's a nice kind of warm Florida day. Mm -hmm. A little cloudy, which is actually kind of better for photography. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but anyway, let's not forget about the housekeeping that we need to do here. You, you should be subscribing to this channel. Hit the little subscribe button right down below. And you should also be following all of our updates on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter to see what's happening here at The Pint. Yes. And the links for all those things are down below. And if you'd like to sign up for our newsletter, which is a fantastic way to get information, you can do that on our website or you can come into the shop and we'll write down your name and email address and do it for you. Yes. So, no excuses. No excuses. So get to the real point of the day. What are you drinking today, Sue? I am drinking a classic. I just, oh, we're not working today either, so I get a full <laughs> beer. Um, this is Narragansett Lager. It's a classic lager from Narragansett out of Rhode Island. And it's also, if you're looking for a bargain, it's only four dollars a pint. What? I know, right? So, and it's delicious. I like it because it's super easy drinking, but it also has a lot of uh, flavor. You know, it's it's got some maltiness, and it's just has flavor as, as well as being a light beer. So, yeah, if you ever want just a beer tasting beer, come there and get go. the Narragansett. Tap number two. Tap number two. How about you? What are you drinking? Well. I'm double fisting it. I decided to do um, something a little different today. I haven't had one of these in a while. A sour. Mm -hmm. So this is lemongrass from Bay Cannon. And it's very light. It's light and refreshing. This is something I like about sours. They're great for hot summer days mm -hmm. because they are light and refreshing. People have been asking for sours late recently too. Mm -hmm. And I like this one as um, one of our regulars came in and said, she said, oh, sometimes the sours, they don't smell great. So you just have to be able to get Oh. past the nose and once you do then it's fine uh, but this one has a really nice nose and actually you can get a lot of the lemongrass <laughs> delicious mm -hmm. i agree okay then i went to a cider because i hadn't done a cider in a little while mm -hmm. and this is black widow so this is not one oh of my goodness no 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 <laughs> <laughs> It's love bug season, apparently. <laughs> Are we continuing on or starting over? <laughs> it's not the end of the world. <laughs> I guess it doesn't taste like love bugs. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> um, then I hadn't had a cider in a while, so I thought I would have this lovely original sin black widow that's one of your favorites it's one of my favorites it's really um kind of sweet tart it's not not overly sweet some ciders can get a little too sweet this one's got nice tartness on it blackberry it's delicious so it's been really popular too there mm -hmm. have been some people who've come in and they just are raving about it yeah i think on um, these are two really nice summer options mm -hmm. i find they go really well with hot weather and that's coming, my friends. That's yes, coming. it is. Yeah. Alrighty. So, let's talk about the news that we have to report here. We uh, want to remind you that for the time being, we are open Tuesday through Saturday, twelve to eight, and closed on Sundays and Mondays. Yes. However, this week we are be closing early on Wednesday at four p.m for a private event. We're going to be doing a Jimmy Mac appreciation night. Mm -hmm. Jimmy Mac was going to be here, but he is otherwise uh, busy. <laughs> He's got too much going on. He can't make it. Yeah, work. Um, <laughs> <laughs> work. Uh, so he is sending us his best and we will celebrate and maybe we'll try to get him on a Zoom call or something. Yeah, yeah. Um, but that means we're closed at four o'clock this Wednesday. Uh, which I don't know the date off the top head. The 20th. The 20th. We'll put it in writing so yep. you can see it. And if you're a Jimmy Mac member and you didn't get the email on that, give us a call and we'll give you the details. Yeah, and come on in. You, if you are a Jimmy Mac member, just we are trying to get a feel for how many people will be here because I'll be cooking up some stuff. Yeah. All right. 
it's gonna be exciting <laughs> you really you missed out if you didn't join Jimmy Mac this year yeah <laughs> uh, okay last week uh, let's talk about last week yeah we had a lot of musicians in last week it we was did. so much fun and I think we got video clips of all of them awesome so yeah you, got, you have to send me that one you got out and okay. then uh, yeah I think we'll be able to insert some video clips you haven't listened to them yet so disclosure there maybe they won't be in here <laughs> uh, so we had Sandra and Alex early in the week on Tuesday that oh, was yeah. my first time hearing them yeah. they were fantastic I have to say, um, A, they seem like lovely people. Yeah, yeah, super nice. And um, and they are very talented. Oh my God, mm -hmm, they are so mm -hmm. talented. Uh, she did an Eminem song, which was fantastic. I think the whole place was enjoying it. Yeah, we, and, um, and I think we got a clip of that one. Yeah, and it's, it's And then she just sang great. a song in French. Yep. So that was fun too. That was Someone fun. requested a song in French and she said, yes, I will play you my favorite Celine Dion song. In French. In French. Uh, and then, Oh wait, so here is a clip of Sandra and Alex, maybe. Okay, and then moving on, we had Scott Mangine later in the week, mm -hmm. and of course, a rockin' time with him, oh, as yeah, always. Oh, yeah, so much fun, yeah. And uh, celebrating a mutual friend's birthday, which mm -hmm. was kind of neat. Everyone got to celebrate Oh, a yeah, bit. they took up the whole community table. Mm -hmm. It was a lot of fun. It was tons of fun. And the employees got a slice of cake. Yes, they did. Um, and we hopefully have a clip of him that you can hear now. <laughs> and then uh, Saturday. Saturday, we had two things going yeah. on. Yeah. Uh, we had, we came in and we celebrated as a team National Wear Your Pajamas to Work Day. Yes. And so the whole team got together. We all had pajamas. A lot of people had matching pajamas. Yeah. That was pretty awesome. Yeah. And it was so much fun. Yep. So that was kind of neat and we have i think we have a picture of everybody here yep, we do it was it was so much fun mm -hmm. we all realized that the pajamas mine were kind of fleecy a little bit warmer than hot. what we normally especially <laughs> the kids in the kitchen <laughs> i felt bad for them but they, they suffered through the whole day and it was awesome um and then later in the day we had michelle ingram yeah. join us and uh, we have a fabulous picture of her with their wonderful fancy car. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, where we can fun. put that up. Um, and I got a clip of her music too, which we'll put here. But yeah, so, so much fun. Um, it was a little slow when she started, and then the people just kept filtering in, and it was such a fun time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all of our artists are so great. Oh my all God, we are time. so lucky. Yeah. Michelle is fantastic. Scott mm -hmm. has so much fun and is really, really talented. Everyone is so talented. Yep, yep. We are just, we are lucky. Yes, yes. Super duper lucky. But we uh, have new stuff coming up this week. Yeah. We have purchased the MLB Extra Innings package. So for all of you baseball fans out there, yeah. you can come see your games, obviously, while we're open. Yep. And that's, <laughs> but the nice thing is, the baseball games, they're all during the week. I mean, mm -hmm. all throughout the week, they have mm -hmm. them on. And a lot of them, you have a game usually every day that starts at 1 and then maybe 1 at 4. So it's not just one day of the week. It's every day you can come in and catch a game. And like you said, up till 8 o'clock. We're going to have all the games on because I don't think there's ever six in a row or six on at the same time. Yeah. So it's, it's great. We can just fill up the TVs with baseball. 
Yeah, it's really cool. And we've already had some fans come in mm -hmm. and request some stuff, so that's yep. cool. And, and who are you rooting for this year? <laughs> Don't ask me that. I always root for the New York Yankees. I know. I live in Florida now. I will probably root for the Seattle Mariners. Okay. That's fair. No. I really don't have any loyalty <laughs> to a baseball team, but I like the Seattle sports team, so why not root for them? Yes. Mm -hmm. and don't know anything about how their record is, but I'm originally go Mariners. Originally from the Bronx, New York, when I was a baby. Mm -hmm. So you know. Yeah, but it's fun. It's been it's, fun. It's I fair. Mean, people have been coming. <laughs> people have been coming in and asking us to turn specific games on. So it's a lot. It's been fun so far, and we're hoping maybe to come up with some. Um, Kind of special, some game-related specials on some of the days. Yeah, should so, be cool. Yeah, should be very cool. Uh, and then a reminder again: on Wednesday, we're closing at four o'clock for our private Jimmy Mac event. So, ooh, excuse me, get all of your um, beer before that. Yes, unless you're a Jimmy Mac member. <laughs> <laughs> if you are a Jimmy Mac member, you'll have to leave at four and come back at five. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna watch us clean a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. um, Okay, so we have events coming up this week. This week on Thursday, we have the MUDS. The MUDS, oh yeah. With their fantastic blues, they are so good. Yeah, it should be a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Should be a lot of fun. Yep, and that'll be 4 to 7. 4 to 7. It's our normal time for music. Yep. And then on the 21st, also on Thursday, it's Get to Know Your Customers Day. Mm -hmm. We know a lot of you. Yeah. But we don't know all of you. No. So, so maybe you know. we'll meet more of you. Yeah, yeah. So we'll be here. Thought it'd be fun to acknowledge that. Get to know your <laughs> customers day. And then on Friday, April 22nd, it is Earth Day. Earth Day. So order some food online and get it in compostable containers to go. <laughs> That's about the best we can do for or Earth Day. Or come in and just have a beer in celebration of Earth and Day. And a glass glass. In a glass glass that we don't have to throw away. With a paper straw. <laughs> you just also raise a glass to Mother Earth. How's there that? There you go. Raise a glass to Mother Earth on Earth Day. <laughs> that sounds fantastic. Um, and then reminder that we have music most Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Yeah. Not all, but no. most. This week's a little light. We just have um, the MUDs on Thursday as our only uh, music. Sometimes just the dates I have open, everyone's already booked those dates, and that's what happened in the next couple weeks. Mm -hmm. But then we got full slates of stuff coming nice. up soon. So nice. never be fear, good the music is back. Yay! Yeah, and the beers. We have new beers this week. Yeah, we didn't put on too many this week. And we didn't put on too many, we put like six or eight last week, and 15 the week before. I think that's probably why. And then we have a lot more that'll probably go this week. So it was just five, but they are worthy. So. First Everything's we, worthy. First, we got Big Hal, which is a brown ale from Hal Patter. We've had it on once before. It's a really good brown ale. It's an I imperial like it. brown, isn't it? No. Oh. That's Hooter Brown. Oh. Hmm. No, this one is just, I think it's 5 or 6%. Hmm. So, yeah, no, it's it's good. It's, an, it's a good one. Okay. And then Working Man Porter from the Ravenous Pig Brewery down in Winter Garden. Winter Park? Winter, Winter Park. Park. Winter Park, yes. And, um... This is a Baltic porter, which is a little different style porter, but it's very, very popular, uh, very traditional. Mm -hmm. It's a traditional style porter. Dryer. It's really good. Yeah. Dryer, not as sweet as Yeah, so they, on the first sip, you'll be like, that's not what I'm used to. But as you drink it, you realize this is a really good Baltic porter. Yeah. So Delicious. give it a shot for sure. And then we have Hazy IPA from Unbranded. And if you've ever had any of the Hazy O series from these folks, uh, their stuff is really good. Yeah, they were they went through a, a series of beers to kind of dial in which they wanted to just have as their hazy, hazy IPA, and this is what they landed on, and it's really good. We had one keg before, a big one, and it went really, really fast. fast for a big <laughs> keg, yeah. So we got another one, mm -hmm. and then we're really excited about this one. Um, Crooked Can is right down in Winter Garden, and we have not been able to get their stuff on, on draft, I don't think ever before, and now they've started distributing again and we got their high stepper IPA which is a really good IPA and I'm just really excited that should um, be fun yeah I haven't tried it yet yeah no it's good it's good I'm so glad that we can get something we love getting beers that are really close by so this is this is exciting to get this one because it's pretty close to us don't be fooled if the 
menu board reads Ohio. They opened up a location in Ohio, and right now that's what our board says. Yeah, it's but, got a default, and I'm trying to, to fix it. Um, but, but it's yeah. from Winter Garden. It's from Winter Garden. <laughs> yeah. So. Not Ohio. No. Uh, and then we have Barnyard Blonde from Oviedo. Yeah, that's really good too. Yeah. I like a nice blonde ale. It's perfect for summer, for yeah. sure. Yeah, definitely getting to be that summer summertime. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. So I think that's all we have for this week. I think so, yeah. I mean, our beers are all delicious. We've gotten so many compliments in the past week or mm-hmm. so. People in from out of town and stuff, and they're like, you have great beers here. We just love the variety. Mm-hmm. A lot of people, they come to um, visit people, and that's the first place they want to come is here. So Yeah, it's pretty awesome. Yeah, so thanks for all your support, everybody. Yes. Keep drinking our beers. And remember, most music on most Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Private event this week at four o'clock on Wednesday so unless you're in Jimmy Mac you can't come at four (laughs) o'clock on Wednesday and if you are Jimmy Mac you can come at five o'clock yeah there you go there you go all right all right and with that we say cheers. cheers